Hey guys, my name is Nick Sivrich. I'm a physical therapist, and I want to go over this week's question of the week with you. This week's question of the week is about bone spurs. What are they, and what are some common areas of the body that they develop? Um, and simply put, uh, a bone spur uh, is basically just um, a buildup of bone. Uh, usually it's around a joint, uh, but, but it can develop in other places. Uh, but basically it's just a buildup of that bone and it can have, you know, different types of ridges. Sometimes they're sharp, um, sometimes they're a little bit rounded, um, but mainly, uh, majority of the time you will find them around joints. So for example, uh, the shoulder is a very common one. You'll get bone spurs and the, the bone here, uh, it's called the acromion, uh, and it basically forms a shelf uh, between the head of your humerus um, and the rotator cuff that kind of goes over top of that and connects in that area. And so what happens sometimes is you'll get some bone spurs on the outside of that, and a lot of times they're pointy at the end. You know, they're pretty sharp. So what happens is you'll raise your arm and you'll get a, ah, yeah, I feel like a sharp pain right there. And usually that's from that bone, uh, that bone spur uh, pushing and, and poking down into the muscle. And over time, that muscle can fray and eventually can actually tear the rotator cuff. So a lot of times that'll happen to people. They won't even know what caused it um, because there wasn't a specific injury, but they're like, oh, I've always had this nagging pain. And then one day it just kind of wouldn't work anymore. Um, a lot of times that'll happen. So that's a real common area uh, for a uh, bone spur to develop. Another common area um, is around the knee uh, or around the hips. A lot of times when people will get a, rota or, um, a rotator cuff, a, uh, uh, a knee replacement, uh, the doctor will say, you know, you had a ton of bone spurs around that joint. No wonder you had so much pain. Uh, and it's just kind of a buildup of bone, a buildup of, um, you know, calcium that uh, forms uh, and it just, you know, hits on different areas. And, and that's the reason why you have so much pain a lot of the times. Um, Another common area, uh, a big one, is the heel. Uh, and this obviously isn't around the joint, uh, but you'll get a heel spur, a bone spur on the heel. And basically what, what happens is when people walk, you know, they obviously, you put that heel down first and they'll describe it as like, feels like there's a pebble in my shoe uh, or I'll have, a, you know, have a sharp pain like right in that area. And you know, nine times out of 10, that's usually what it is. It's that, that bone spur and it's like kind of pointy or even round. Um, and pushing down on that fat pad causing pain. Uh, a lot of times people uh, will come to therapy for that or they'll, you know, sometimes the doctor will go in and kind of shave that down to give them some relief. Um, so I hope that helped this week, guys. Um, if you have any questions, like I said, feel free to contact me. And if you have any of these type of symptoms, you know, if you're getting pain, lifting your arm, you got that sharp pain, um, as well as you know that, that pebble feeling in your shoe or even sharp pain in your heel, please go see a physical therapist. You know, uh, we'll evaluate you. Uh, if we feel that you need treated, we will treat you. Otherwise, uh, we can send you out to the appropriate person to kind of get checked out for other things. So um, have a good week, guys. Thanks. Appreciate it. <music>